All right, by now it should be overly apparent to you that a group of elite pedophiles are being taken down. Uh, if you saw the news yesterday, you saw that Twitter was hacked in a Bitcoin scam. Well, I'm here to tell you that Bitcoin scam, that Twitter hack, it's actually about taking down a ring of elite pedophiles. And I'm going to show you why right now. Let's take a look at the story. Major U.S. Twitter accounts hacked in Bitcoin scam. Billionaires Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, and Bill Gates are among many prominent U.S. figures targeted by hackers on Twitter in an apparent Bitcoin scam. But it wasn't just a Bitcoin scam, and we're going to get to that in a moment. The official accounts of Barack Obama, Joe Biden, Kanye West also requested donations in the cryptocurrency. Uh, everyone is asking me to give back. A tweet from Mr. Gates' account said, you send 1,000, I'll send you 2,000 back. Uh, Twitter said it was a coordinated attack targeting its employees with access to internal systems and tools. Uh, here you see two of the tweets that were quickly deleted uh, when the hack first took place from Joe Biden and Barack Obama. Now, what the media is not telling you is that not only were these uh, Twitter accounts hacked and these Bitcoin scam tweets posted, but some of these people were locked out of their account all day long for hours and hours. Twitter could not even access these accounts to pull down the tweets. Uh, Bill Gates is one of them. That account was locked all day. The tweets stayed up all day long. Now, the internet rumor is that these accounts were locked because a group of people who are trying to expose pedophilia in Hollywood and in, in elite politician circles these people were downloading information, downloading all the private messages, all the DMs, because they're going to use the information to expose more of these sick pedos. Now here, Marfugal News is on it. Uh, he's, he tweeted this last night. Rumor has it the Twitter hackers were able to download all of the DMs of all of the hacked accounts. You guys, uh, the media is not going to tell you this. But that Bitcoin scam tweet, that Twitter hack, it wasn't just about hacking Twitter and making money with a Bitcoin scam. It was about getting into these accounts and getting all their private messages so that they could be used as evidence to bring down more people in this ring of sick pedophiles. Um, and the story goes a little deeper. Is anyone familiar with Chrissy Teigen? She's married to the famous musician John Legend. Well, take a look at this. Tokyo bound flight with Chrissy Teigen forced to return to Los Angeles. So apparently, as of now, they're still in the country, and I think I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna expose to you why. Uh, Chrissy Teigen and John Legend they got on this flight headed for Tokyo. They were four hours into the flight uh, across the ocean, leaving from Los Angeles, when the, when the flight was turned around and brought back to LA. So they were in the air for eight hours total just to turn around and come back. Now, the media is saying that two brothers with similar names had boarded the plane uh, with only one ticket. So when the flight attendants did a head count four hours into the flight, they saw there was an extra person. The pilot decided to turn around and come back to LA. Well, I'm here to tell you that's the cover story in the media because the media is trying to keep a lid on this group of pedo elites being taken down. The truth of the matter is uh, Chrissy Teigen and John Legend were trying to flee the country and their flight got turned around and they got brought back because they're two of the people who are going to be going down in this elite pedo ring. And I'm going to show you why right now. Let's take a look at this news article. Um, Chrissy Teigen says she's blocked 1 million Twitter users and deleted 60,000 tweets. Would you guys like to see some of the tweets she's deleted? I'm going to show you. Take a look at this. Um, here's some of the tweets. Let's read them. I just saw a baby that looked like a porn star, like a trashy do-anything porn star. Is this wrong to think? She deleted that. Uh, here's another one. Water slide that goes through a shark tank. F yeah, time to get my pedo on. She deleted that one too. Seeing little girls do the splits half naked is just dot dot dot. I want to put myself in jail. Toddlers and tiaras. This is an elite supermodel married to John Legend. 
So if she's uh, this big into the sick, twisted pedo shit, uh, I, I'm assuming he is too, right? Listen, these people are being taken down. Those Twitter accounts, they were hacked last night so that uh, this group who's exposing these people could get access to their private messages and use them to bust this pedo ring wide open. And you want to know where it all started? Um, I'll show you. This is what started it all. A couple years ago, Trump signs bill renewing NSA's internet surveillance program. You get it? So that they could hack things like Twitter legally, so that they could expose and break up this ring of sick pedophile elites. I'm, I'm, I'm on track. I see exactly what's going on. They're trying to bring them down. The left is fighting back. They're trying to overthrow the country with protests and riots and defund the police. They're trying to get rid of the police before they get arrested for the sick crimes they've been committed. Now, thank you guys very much. Uh, I'd love to hear your comments on these topics below. And also, please consider showing your support. I've been banned everywhere except for private sites that are behind a paywall. So please consider coming over to Patreon. It's www.patreon.com forward slash truth family. Please come, please come over, join our team, uh, help us gather information, show support, and help us expose these people too. Thank you very much. John X Army.